Terrorist attacks like this one in Bangladesh have the world on alert tonight. Here in the U.S., of course, millions of us are traveling for the 4th of July weekend. And DIA is ranked 7th busiest airport for 4th of July travel. Denver 7's Mark Stewart is live at DIA and um, get there early, I'm guessing, is what they want you to do. Absolutely, Shad. And talking to the feds this afternoon, the TSA really is stressing the importance of getting here about two hours before your flight. Security, obviously a concern, but so too is passenger volume. As many as 68,000 people will pass through here each day of the holiday weekend. The July 4th rush is taking off at DIA. The airport could see record-setting passenger counts over the holiday weekend. Flyers are arriving early, including Jennifer Jackson, who is heading to Los Angeles. I actually have TSA pre-check, and I still showed up like two hours early just because I saw in the news that it was going to be crazy this weekend. Just how busy will it get? DIA expects to handle 1.2 million passengers between June 28th through July 4th. That's a 13% increase from last year. After this week's terrorist attack at the airport in Istanbul, Turkey, security is top of mind, overseas and here at home. The TSA sending Denver 7 this statement late Friday, saying its primary focus is the current threat environment, as the American transportation system remains a high-value target for terrorists. We continue to encourage the public to travel, to associate, to celebrate the holidays, to celebrate the July 4th holiday, but be aware and be vigilant. Events on the other side of the world, creating a new awareness of safety and security on all corners of the globe. I don't feel threatened here, but yeah, it's definitely kind of scary to see what's been going on. Some times of day are busier than others, according to DIA, between 5 and 10 a.m., and then again between 1 and 4 p.m. Those are the rush times here at the checkpoint. Live at DIA tonight, Mark Seward, Denver 7. Thank you, Mark.